Herzlich willkommen. Welcome. I'll start by introducing myself. Guten Tag, ich heiße Frau Rosillo. Hello, my name is Miss Rosillo and I am area leader for German here at Prince Henry's Grammar School. This is an introduction to GCSE German as one of your option subjects. In this short video, we will start with why take GCSE German, move on to look at answers to frequently asked questions, and finally, I will direct you to places where you can access further information if you require it. By taking GCSE German, you are becoming a dual linguist, studying both GCSE French or Spanish and GCSE German. So let's look at why this idea of becoming a dual linguist has lots of advantages. German is spoken by over 120 million people and with the global dimension playing an ever increasing role in society, learning the language of one of Europe's most successful countries cannot be overlooked. Dual linguists are highly sought after in many areas of society. Taking German in addition to French and Spanish could help you boost your career and earnings in the future. Here are some examples of well-known global businesses who are keen to employ students with language qualifications. Whether working in the travel industry, business, finance or the armed forces, languages will always help open doors and allow you to see and experience the world in a unique and fulfilling way. So why else take GCSE German? By becoming a dual linguist, you will develop key transferable skills. Here are some examples. And in addition, we are really lucky at Prince Henry's to have a German foreign language assistant each year. At GCSE, you will have the chance to work with the foreign language assistant, either individually or in small groups. And this personalised approach really supports the students in developing these skills, particularly communication and speaking. So, other reasons for taking GCSE German. Most GCSE German students continue with their studies in the sixth form and then later at degree level in order to develop their skills as fully as possible before going into the world of work. Here are some of our former students and their destinations following their path as a dual linguist at GCSE. You will see we have a range of jobs, examples of red brick universities and a wide range of degrees which languages can be combined with. There really are some fantastic opportunities as a dual linguist. So finally in this section, what do our students say about becoming a dual linguist? Here are some quotes from our current GCSE students to give you an insight into their experience as a dual linguist. So we will move on now to what type of student would GCSE German appeal to? Well, first and foremost, I think you really should enjoy learning German. GCSEs are hard work and a challenge, but if you really enjoy learning German, then the motivation to do really well is already there. Other desirable qualities would be an interest in languages and culture, keen to use languages in the future or as a career, and an interest in travel. So let's move forward now to the next section, where I will aim to answer common, frequently asked questions which we would normally get at the options evening. Becoming a dual linguist is an option which is not widely available in many schools, but here at Prince Henry's we are able to offer you this opportunity. The course follows exactly the same structure as the AQA GCSEs in French and Spanish. Students are able to transfer and adapt their skills from one language to another and ensure they achieve their potential in not just one but two languages. Students study German in addition to French or Spanish depending on the mini school. There is some overlap at GCSE with the key stage three curriculum. The course continues to allow students to develop their vocabulary, structures and grammar. Despite starting German as a new language in year eight, compared with starting French or Spanish in year seven, students do perform well at GCSE German. And we are really proud of our results. Here we have our results from the past two years, 94% grades nine to four. And finally, the class sizes for GCSE German tend to be slightly smaller to allow for more tailored teaching to students' needs. For further information, I would direct you to information in the options booklet. In addition, there is also information on our website, or alternatively, you can use the email here to contact um, school where more information can be provided. As a feel and dank, thank you for watching this short video. I hope it has been useful. Auf Wiedersehen!